Dearly beloved, we gather together here in the sight of God and in the face of this company to join together this man and this woman in holy matrimony, which is commended of St. Paul to be honorable among all men, and therefore not by any to be entered into unadvisedly or lightly, but reverently, discreetly, advisedly, soberly, and in the fear of God. Into this holy estate, these two present here come now to be joined. I, John Asaidan Kwan, take the take the kosher if you are under the to be my to be my wedded wife to be my wedded wife to have and to hold to have and to hold from this day forward from this day forward for better for worse for richer for poorer in sickness and in health in sickness and in health to love to love cherish and to obey to death as do part. According to God's holy ordinance, to God's holy and there too, I give thee my pledge. Just a quick speech. To me, I don't have an older sister, but Portia to me has been an older sister for as long as I can remember. And first of all, I want to say I'm so blessed and privileged to be a witness to this holy matrimony. Like this day and age, there's a lot of couples that aren't really a good example of what a Christian couple are. But Portia and John, to me, have been a very prime example of a couple that a lot of us young people should look up to. So I just want to say God bless you with that. I remember when Portia told me about John. And I know some of us in this room know how sometimes Portia can be kind of stubborn, you know. But she gave him a chance and almost two years later, she's sitting in this very chair <laughs> with the love of her life. John, I just want to say how happy you have made Portia. You have made her so happy. The glow on this girl's face, the way she's smiling today is like no other. And honestly, I'm just looking forward to the babies, the babies, more babies. Amen. More babies and more babies. God bless you. Amen. My name is Joel. I say it I'm I'm the clone of John. <laughs> um, I'm so honored to be here today um, witnessing this beautiful union of my brother and his beautiful wife, Portia. You know, um, I remember when well, I'm gonna tell you how Porsche, John and Porsche met. So we were um, at a Thanksgiving service of our dear departed auntie, Auntie um, Cynthia Manful, and we're sitting upstairs on the, I think on the right hand side, yeah. And Porsche was ministering, and my brother was like, "Yo, who's that girl?" I'm like. Bro, we had Thanksgiving service, what are you doing? Why, why are you looking at girls? Uh, come on. <laughs> so, um, after the service, I think he must have gone to my auntie, Auntie Mercy, to make your you know, to do investigation. <laughs> um, so, so after, after some time, <laughs> after some time, um, I started to see changes in John. Sometimes this guy will be in his room and giggling and laughing. I'm like, ah, what's going on? I'll go and he's lying on his bed with his legs up high or lean on the wall. I'm like, bro, like, 